What's up guys, here is Claudio from Visual Mode WordPress Teams and in today's video I'm gonna guide you through the most used WordPress and internet e-commerce platform, the WooCommerce WordPress plugin, present around 30% of the entire online stores, this is really a good e-commerce plugin. As you can see, a, a shopping page and here a um, single product page and uh, a sale proceeding, go to cart, checkout and the payment. So how to do a page like this? How to create a shop in WordPress? First, let's talk about the WooCommerce. This is the plugin page, the official developers plugin page and here you can download it on wordpress.org you can also download it on WordPress, Dashboard, Plugins, Add New, search for WooCommerce and click on Install barra Activate. As soon as you activate this plugin, it will look like this. WooCommerce, Settings. Activate it. And you will not see two new tabs inside your WordPress dashboard, the WooCommerce and the Products. Let's start with the Products and Add New so you can have something on sale this is the first step as you can see i already have i already have some products on it um, let's enter in this who single number two as you can see the title and the description wordpress theme users can use the page builder the drag and drop page builder to create this description and here you can have the product data like general, inventory, shopping, links, attributes and advanced fields. So you can use product variations like color, size. Also we have a product titles area here, but here it comes from another video and here the short description, the description that stays side by side with the product image. Here is the short description. Here is the long description, reviews, project gallery, and project filtered image. And here is, here you go to the WooCommerce template. So, how to set this page to be your WordPress shop page and loads the WooCommerce main template? Go to the WooCommerce settings, so we can choose some page. This is the WooCommerce settings. As you can see, you can add your address, your currency, and everything you want. So, products. And here, we select the shop page. This page needs to be created previously on pages, add new. Just create a page, call it as shop, and no need to add any content on it, you just need to have the page on your site. Select this page, set it up in the way that you want, save changes, and all done. The page selected to be your shop page will load this WooCommerce shop template with products, sidebars, and now let's talk about these widgets like price filters, products, top hated products, and some text content. How to edit? You will go to WordPress, Dashboard, Appearance, Widgets. Click on it and you will notice a WooCommerce tab. Here you will be able to drag and drop widgets with any content that you want. You also will notice a lot of WooCommerce widgets. Just like exclusive visual model widgets, so you can design better this area. And now let's talk about these extra pages like my account, cart, checkout. These pages need to be created as well. How to do that? Go to Pages, Add New, Add a new page, name this page as my account or any other title that you want. I already have a page with my account, let's use another title. And let's do it in the easy form, without shortcodes. 
go to WordPress, add new, backend or frontend editor, select the WooCommerce tab, my account. Just save changes. This is another of our theme page builder settings and limits to make it easier. Okay, the page is done. Save it. By clicking in the publish button. Okay, we already have a shop uh, a shop account page. Now we need to talk to the plugin what page will be our or account page. Go to WordPress, Dashboard, WooCommerce, Settings, and Advanced. In Advanced, you will be able to set your card page, checkout page, and my account page. Also, a terms and conditions page. All these pages will need to be created using the form I just explained it. Select and off, save changes, and all done. Now, let's link to this, let's link this page to the menu. Go to WordPress, Appearance, Menus, select the page, add to the menu, and drag it and drop in the area, like you do with all the other pages that you create. The same process will be used to any page. Now, let's talk about the, this image, the size and format of it. In the case that you want to change, go to WordPress, Appearance, Customize. WooCommerce. Product Image. Here you set the size of these images and the format. We always recommend use the default settings and add big images, like 100 by 100 pixels, for example. Now, let's talk about the shopping page title. This is a visual model exclusive option. As you can see, visual model, theme options, WooCommerce. Here you can set the sidebars or remove or change in the way that you want for shop page or single pro single product page and here you can set the page title like menu overlay background image header size title and caption all will be easy editable I hope you guys enjoyed this video, come here back later for more, and all the best!